One of the benefits of playing the Super Bowl in a domed stadium, you don't have to worry about the weather, but you do have to worry about power. So when half the lights went out in the Super Bowl tonight, well, that was a problem. Eyewitness News sports anchor Laura Benke shed some light on the very strange situation. Laura? Well, Joe, when it comes to the Super Bowl, they come up with odds on just about everything, from the game winner, of course, to the coin toss winner, to the number of first downs, even to details of the halftime show. Pretty fair to say, though, no one saw the lights going out in the Superdome. That, though, is exactly what happened. Just a few minutes into the start of the third quarter, there was a power surge and a huge block of lights went out in the Superdome. At the time, the Ravens led the 49ers 28 to 6. The game was delayed about 34 minutes, with players from both teams doing everything they could to stay loose out on the field. Police officials said too much electricity, electricity was going into the Superdome, which created the surge. The NFL says it's investigating the cause. One team, though, that was not complaining, the 49ers, who then went on a run but came up just short.